Hello everybody, in today's video I have a very special unboxing. This is actually from a fan who wanted to send me a bunch of puzzles for this channel. His name is Kyler. Kyler, thank you very much. Um, me and Kyler talk all the time on Facebook. He's one of my fans that I talk to regularly and uh, and do not uh, know personally. Like I know, I guess we got to know each other a bit now, but uh, I've never met him. And he's a big fan of mine and both my channels and he sent me this to Give me some content for you guys, so thanks, Kyler. All right, so we have a lot of puzzles here. Okay. So we got this one too. So it looks like we have a theme of them here. <laughs> All right. This one, oh, a metal puzzle. This one looks like really high quality, nice, nice metal puzzle. I guess this the uh, thing with this one is to get the ring off. And we have a note. Answer keys. I don't want to look at that. <laughs> but thanks for providing them. Alright. We got another one. This one is also, I think, maybe get the ring off. Old time puzzle. Little barrel puzzle. These are nice little wooden puzzles. A circle. I uh, actually have a copy of this, but it's not in this good of condition, so that's nice. That's a uh, little six-piece burr. Little tiny puzzle. These ones are cool. I think that you move them around and you have to try to get it in different patterns. Wow, he really like sent me a lot of cool stuff. Wow. So the whole thing is to get this ring off of the spring. Oh, wow. <laughs> this one is cool. You know what? Uh, he showed me a picture of this one and said, this is one of the puzzles that I'll be sending you. And this one, I built one of these in grade eight metalworks class, but it was not near this awesome quality. So I already know how to solve this and I'm really looking forward to making this video. So I'm not 100% sure of the actual point of this probably get the ring off or get this this piece here off that one looks interesting all right and I got a note from Kyler as well if you guys want go ahead and pause that and read it I just read it thank you very much Kyler you're awesome all right let's take a little bit of a closer look at each of these but I will be reviewing them separately on my channel some I might do together so this looks like an 18 piece burr with pegs I think I already know uh, this is sort of like the pegs restrict things and then uh, there's like a key, like a master one that has no restriction. You can pull that out and then you can start pulling them out one at a time and figure out how to put them back together from there. So this is basically just a 12 piece burr. I'm guessing it's pretty simple, but I could be wrong. It's got a 3 out of 5 difficulty. The fact that it's been mass produced tells me that it's, it's quite simple because uh, I design burr puzzles myself and I've designed some seriously hard ones and uh, they don't really get a whole lot of attention to be honest. This one here is quite heavy, it's a six piece burr as well and uh, I believe this one I already know the solution to from seeing it on somebody else's channel but it'll be great to, uh, to show this one on this channel. So these are smaller little wooden puzzles and uh, he said that yeah some of them in the, in the letter if you read it, <clears throat> some of them might fall apart, they're not broken and I have dealt with smaller puzzles like this and I knew they I knew that they do fall apart. So I think what I would do is probably split this up into two videos, three and three, because they're fairly simple. So he said in his letter also, I'm sure you will enjoy the metal puzzles and from the look of them, I'm sure I will because they are very high quality, I can tell already. This one here has got me really thinking. This is just a spring and you gotta get it off the spring, I guess. I'll have to look up exactly what it is, but I'm pretty sure that's what it is because there's only two pieces. What else would you do with it? So the cool thing about these type of puzzles is like I've never seen this puzzle before. I have no idea exactly what the purpose of I'm guessing to get this ring off. That's my guess so far. I'm sure it says on here, but I'll look at that during the review. But it's not a Rubik's Cube type of puzzle where it's the same kind of method um, that you just apply to different scrambles. This is a completely own puzzle. Like if you don't, you, you literally have to figure it out which is the really fun part why I enjoy these puzzles because they're all different. So I know that you have to get the ring off of this one. I have seen this one in the past. I don't know the solution to it. I'm not gonna look up the solution to it either. Um, but I, I have seen this puzzle before too. So I know it's a, quite a popular one and I can't wait to check this one out. 
So this one looks really complicated. <laughs> uh, I'm guessing, I'm guessing you gotta remove, I don't know what it is exactly that you remove on this one. Maybe it's this piece, maybe it's dismantle it as far as you can. I'm not 100% sure yet. This is the last in this sort of yellow net stuff that we have. And uh, I'm guessing here it's to get this long brass piece off. That's, that's what I think. And yeah, this is the last one and uh, I can't wait to review this one. So this one here is going to be the first one out of all of these that I review. Okay, again, Kyler, thank you very much for sending me this. You're awesome. Thanks for watching guys and I'll see you on my next video.